congratulations for being here at San Diego Comic Con. I'm sure this is not the first time here for you. No, I've been here a couple times. Yeah, the last time was uh, Ridley Scott's director's cut release of Blade Runner. Most excellent. So how does it feel being back here? I mean, for a lot of people, it's been a long time. I mean, you know, one mm -hmm. or two years, but how about for yourself? Well, I, I have friends uh, that live in Oceanside, oh. school, school time, school age kids that I've known like, oh God, 50 years, you know. And um, so I've been down here before, but not at the Comic-Con. And, you know, it's... Um, it's fine. I mean, I'm, you know, I'm not a fanatic or anything, but I know a lot of people enjoy the Comic-Con, and my sister and my niece are coming tomorrow, so they're going to be roaming around, which will be fun, and um, uh, it's nice to do stuff like this when you have your family members with you, and you can, or your loved ones, or whatever. It's, people enjoy it. Most excellent, and of course, you're, you're going to have a different type of experience because you're going to be on a panel for Asylum. Um, you know, th this weekend. Tell, tell us, uh, you know, what are you here to present and, and your experience with Asylum? Well, Asylum did a show that I was in called Planet Dune, and uh, Emily Killian starred in it, and I played a, a, a character role in it, but it's a story about a woman who risks everything to save some crew members on Planet Dune where these snakes come and gobble you up. It's sort of, you know, very similar to the original Dune, which I was also in. Hmm. Um, so I think that that's fun. Asylum's a great company to work for, especially for actresses over 60, you know. They, they, they still appreciate us, and it's really nice to be a part of a company that's kind of equally, equally diverse in all kinds of directions, not just one direction. So that's always inspiring. Now, you've done a lot of great uh, projects over your career. What what, what would you put up on top that you're most proud of? Well, obviously Blade Runner. I mean, that's probably the best film I got to work on, but I was also in Ace Ventura and Wall Street and No Way Out and Fatal Instinct. People have not seen that one as much as the others, but it's really funny. I like comedy, and it's just been, you know, my sister and I kind of joke about this, like people will say if you're over 60 that you're a has-been, and I always say, hey, at least I was a bin, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so it's nice to be appreciated and nice to be still working at this age. Well, who knows? Maybe, maybe there will be a career rejuvenation. I mean, after all, we're revisiting some of those uh, properties right now. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, perfect. And, and for yourself, just to wrap things up, but what, what's up next for you then? Well, I think I'm going to do another show with Asylum. Um, they've definitely asked me what I want to do, so I'm figuring that out now. And um, I'm a good writer, and I'm a, I'm, I, I basically, my life is pretty simple. I like to do my yoga every day, and I, I do tap dancing on mm. Friday. And, um, you know, it's a, it's a very peaceful life I live now which I love. So committing to work is definitely a commitment because, you know, then you have to suit up and get out there and get going. So it's kind of, you want it to be a good experience and want it to be the right material. Most well, excellent. That's a great answer. Well, enjoy, enjoy the rest of Comic-Con. Enjoy with your family. Thank you. Thank you.